All right, guys, what's up? Uh, I said I would try to get a video out. <clears throat> so, I am uh, here trying to get this in. Um, so, uh, I'm still not sure uh, what my schedule looks like. Uh, I also said in that last video that I was uh, going to get some information out about um, my plans for streaming uh, still don't have anything solid for that yet uh, uh, definitely leaning towards a mixer right now because I do want to uh, show off <coughs> uh, patch uh, or the old game before they bring that patch to or patch 2.0 to consoles. Uh, so, uh, if you uh, notice, I've started a new video uh, series, uh, Final Fantasy uh, 14. Uh, put that up on the channel a little bit earlier. Uh, so if you're interested in 14, uh, if you've never played it, uh, you can go check that out. Uh, it's from, um, I didn't go with my high level character, or higher level character. I went with uh, a new character. Uh, and I explained why in the video. Uh, for now, uh, this is still probably going to be my uh, main series. Uh, so last night, uh, after I made uh, the video, I had mentioned that I uh, wanted to go back to just using uh, melee weapons. And I got lucky and actually did get a drop that allowed me to ditch the sniper rifle. And I really have been enjoying... Uh, this dual wielding. Uh, now, here's like I noticed when I went with the two hander, uh, I did that out of uh, I can't remember what level it was when I switched from the two hander to uh, using the two um, two handers. Uh, I got that backwards, I do believe. Um, instead of using the dual wielding one handers and switched over to using just two uh, two handers, what I found <clears throat> was that whatever level I was at when that happened, that it just seemed like the uh, dual wielding wasn't doing as much damage well now uh, it really seems like dual wielding is working a lot better and that probably comes with the uh, territory because you've leveled up the weapons obviously have more damage uh, also you get more of your skill points to put on your character and go into uh, <clears throat> your physical DPS and things like that, however you spec your character. So all of that plays a factor. So as we, you know, progress, uh, things that may not have been as good seem a little better. And, you know, I'm only level 43 right now, so... You know, maybe as we progress along, that'll change again. So last night, after I finished the video, I continued to play, and I did, if you notice, gained a a couple levels. So it's not. Not anything major, but we're progressing. You know, that's more than I've been able to do 
uh, not being around to play, so I'm pretty happy about that, seeing progress again. And uh, that, that right there is one thing that gets me into so much trouble in this game, is not paying attention to um, enemy types. You have to be careful when you're killing um, psychers in this game because they do have their little uh, explosion on death and it's known to one-shot. <laughs> At least it'll one-shot my character. I don't know about Crusaders. Now, I actually don't know if it would one-shot my character if I had spec my character different. Alright, so that is the mission. I'm going to go over here and see if there's a treasure chest or anything. This was actually a pretty quick mission. So, as I keep playing this game... Oh, hell brute. That could end ugly for me. So as I keep playing this game, you know, I'm finding that um, I do have a lot more fun with it. I, especially, it's a lot like, um, a lot like um, Diablo uh, in that regard. I saw, or I didn't see, I've actually had this conversation before, um, <clears throat> that I've had uh, actually a couple of my uh, friends uh, tell me that Diablo 3 in particular um, like the further they played along the game they lost interest in it uh, and I think a good mark of games like this is you know the more we go along the more fun we have and that's what I'm feeling with this game. Uh, and that's... It's kind of surprising to me, in a way, uh, due to the fact that... Well, for one, we don't have any... Well, obviously, we don't have any skills that we're gaining along the way. So, that's a big issue. Alright. So, I will be damned if I didn't get an upgrade for once. But is it worth it? And I'm actually... I'm going to actually take this one. Because I like that uh, vulnerability debuff. I still like my poison debuff, but I'm also of the opinion that I like, <laughs> I just like to get upgrades, even if they're kind of questionable sometimes, but I do like the vulnerability. So let's see what we've got here. So we've got rescue missions, and see now we're getting down to where the level 41 stuff's not even worth their time, and that's a shame because that's a decent amount. So we'll try this. Frozen Wasteland, I don't really mind this one. I've had some issues on this map before uh, hopefully nothing this time so coming up uh, with this game um, if I finish the main story I'm probably going to start 
a new character. Uh, I haven't decided what, though. Probably a Crusader. I have a bad feeling about this mission for some reason. I have a feeling that, uh... I'm gonna not do so well in this one. I don't know why. And if we do... If we do bad, that's fine. I'm not... A, conf a confederate design on that. Always weird to see. See, not paying attention there. Just happened to just happened to look down and see that. So let's go back to these and see. Now I'm quite sure these are the uh, better option. So we want to go over here. Now, I do know uh, I'll definitely be checking into if I do uh, actually I may not thinking on that because there's one thing I got really tired of with these games um, it's a uh, it's one of my uh, actually family members um, drove me absolutely crazy um, over uh, not using the so-called recommended specs. And I was thinking, uh, if I make a Crusader, I might look into what's the so-called uh, best spec. But I don't think I'm going to. Um, I'm going to play it my way. Because that, that really got old um, while I was playing uh, other games. You know, I'm not playing, I'm not playing these games to, uh, to hear that. Now, if I, if I had been playing and I'll just say it was, um, it was definitely Diablo when that happened and I didn't have the uh, proper skill set up for their liking, uh, and I don't really care. I wasn't doing the highest level stuff in the game. I was just playing to have fun. You know, that was it. And that's pretty much what I'm doing here. If I decide to, to do that, then sure. We can min-max. Whatever. But for now, I'm going to play it my way. And if my way doesn't work out, or if I notice that you know, I'm getting slaughtered. I'll know I've made a mistake. And then I might look it up. But I think too often we get caught up in trying to, to eke out that last little damage point that we could, we just forget how do we want to do things. Now, I can tell you, I've set this character up, and I've regretted a couple of things I've done on this character just because uh, that's not what I really would have wanted to do. I was getting ready to say, if that bugged out, I was not going to be happy. But, you know, <clears throat> I'm guilty of it, too. 
Don't get me wrong. I'm not trying to play innocent here. Don't think for a second I'm trying to play innocent because I'm just as guilty as... I think at some point if we've all played games like this, we're probably guilty of it. And it's not really that big of a deal if we're not being uh if we're not being a douchebag about it you know i don't think it's uh it's really that big a deal we can offer helpful advice but you know the specific case i mentioned it did cross a line and it did piss me off uh so this one i just i just wing it and that's i'm having fun doing it i do know i've made some mistakes um trying to fix them now that I have more skill points so uh, you know this was a quick video uh, pretty much just an update to let you all know that um, I am uh, still pretty much unsure what's going to happen uh, I'm going to try uh, later today to record some extra footage uh, hopefully um, I can get that uploaded uh, and have it waiting because I'm still, if I have to go, unsure what the internet situation is going to be like. Um, and I did um, get prepared so that if it's gone, at least I can uh, hopefully get something out there. Uh, and Shadowbringers, uh, definitely watch for some more of that if you're a fan. Uh, also, uh, I did mention in that last video that I had bought the uh, some of the DLCs for this game during the Steam sale. I picked up some other games from the Steam sale. Uh, so you'll probably see a, uh, even though they're, they're older games, you'll probably still see a reaction to them. Um, you'll see that, um, give my opinion. And I'm doing, um, when I do those, uh, it'll be first take impressions. Uh, I haven't done them for a while. Uh, I don't even know if I've done one, actually. So that's how I'm going to do it. Um, I might eventually do a full-scale review of a game uh, after I've played through and completed it. Uh, either way, what I will be doing is full-scale review. There's a couple of them I'm really wanting to boot up. And uh, when I do those... It'll be um, my first take on them. The only exception to that is going to be Death Road to Canada because I've been eyeing that game for two years and I did play about 20 minutes of it uh, just to see it. And I will probably be putting that one out uh, soon, but I'm not going to play it again until I actually uh, do the video on it. So anyway, guys, if... As always, you have any suggestions or comments, uh, leave me. A, go ahead and just leave that down there. I f you can feel free to leave me a message as well. Uh, be sure to um, subscribe, give me a like. Uh, speaking of that, uh, trying to get some new equipment. I did buy a. <laughs> I bought me a camera, uh, but my kid really wanted it, um, and, uh, you know, he's been through a lot with, uh, the situation with, uh, our family, so I gave it to him, so another camera, uh, probably in the future, we'll get to that, uh, anyway, guys, uh, keep your eye out, hopefully, I uh, get an upgraded microphone soon, uh, and maybe another camera, uh, and uh, Mixer and Twitch coming uh, probably uh, it might come this week if I don't have to go out of town. So anyway, guys, I keep appreciate you guys who keep watching. Uh, just keep your eye out, subscribe, enable those notifications. Uh, thanks again.